hey guys good morning good morning good morning so i think today i might start the vlog um today is a is a great day it's a beautiful day and it's also the due date of baby girl i'm 40 weeks pregnant now baby girl is still not here so i'm waiting um my baby is still growing uh look at that so beautiful yeah so i'm getting ready now to go to the to my doctor appointment so they can check if everything is okay with the baby with me and everything you know all the good stuff and so i'm gonna go with you hopefully they let me film you know let's go guys i'm running late <laughs> Good morning. Which one? at the doctor's appointment and baby girl is okay they did um, a test like a stress test the NSC test to see if you know if everything was okay with her so she's okay I'm okay um, but I'm still not dilated yet <laughs> today is Wednesday I have another appointment with them on Monday to see so we do like the, the the same thing to see if she's okay but by monday if you know if i'm still not in labor in labor by monday they're gonna induce me um on wednesday so yeah this is the update with baby so she's still chilling she's taking her time I kind of agree with her because the world is is just crazy right now she she's just not you know she's just not ready for this crazy world <laughs> oh man yeah so I'm so happy everything is okay now I'm going to run some errands and and get back home yeah Good morning guys I forgot to to close the video yesterday um, so now after getting ready I'm gonna have breakfast and then I'm gonna film what's in my diaper bag and hospital bag for you because I think it's a long overdue video since I promised I would do that and I will also give you an update about the third trimester as well so it's gonna be one vlog with different updates yeah so it's all about the pregnancy for this vlog i know i know now let's go take a shower with me no i'm kidding i'm joking you're not gonna see anything the shower I'm gonna I'm gonna do my face routine in the morning if you guys want a morning routine or a night routine with me please comment below I will make that happen I want to shave my hair but I've been too lazy lately to shave it myself 
and since my personal barber is on probation right now <laughs> no I'm I'm joking guys he, he's not on probation he's just you know very busy he's at work um, so I guess I'm gonna do it myself one of these days and I have to because baby girl is coming soon so I I really have to get ready my nails are already done clean and fresh today I'm gonna use only those three it's my vitamin my vitamin C from Sunday Riley another product from Sunday Riley good jeans and then I have my SPF from La Roche Posay. I have to tell you guys, my skin have suffered a lot from the pregnancy. Before it was healthy, you know, glowing, very nice, without acne. So yeah. So after the pregnancy, I hope he, it goes back to, to normal. So I have the cart. I have a cart. It's like a moving cart. Um, where I organize um, diapers and stuff like that where I'm gonna use um, at night or during the day too for the baby so let me show you yeah this is this card and it's not fully done yet like I said on top of the card mostly I'm gonna put all the uh, food stuff like bottle pacifiers and burp cloth and also probably my breast pump and then here i put diapers and changing pads wipes and you know baby stuff for diaper and here i have extra clothes and swaddle blankets and you know do um and other and other baby baby products so yeah this is how i organize this this card and it's gonna be very useful at night you can roll it and move it wherever you want update for the dresser now it's more full you know it's more full of clothes but not too too much you know just the thing that she gonna need for the first three months also yeah mostly blankets breakfast is ready um i'm gonna eat i'm gonna eat only fruits this morning with a little bit of yogurt Ooh. oh my goodness i'm tired yeah um i just finished my breakfast now i'm gonna give you an update of how my third pregnancy have been so far i'm 40 weeks pregnant 40 weeks and one day pregnant so baby girl can come any day you know we're just waiting on her i'm gonna go through my notes so i don't miss anything for the third trimester uh what really haven't changed at all is the back pain like i told you you know um from my previous video of um doing an update about the first and the third um, and the second trimester the back pain is still constant it never went away so yeah i have some exercises that i do um almost every day uh, when it's it is worse i I do those exercises, they really help me. The pelvic pain as well be, um, stay constant because baby is getting heavier. Um, she She's getting more pounds, you know, and your pelvic is opening more and more every day. So it can make 
place for the baby to come when the time comes so, so the baby can come out and yeah so this is one thing that never go go away and <laughs> one of the new thing is the penguin walk I, I kind of like lose balance of my body because you know my body is very heavy right now and when I'm walking I am like balancing like <laughs> like a penguin that's why we call that like the penguin walk <laughs> so funny and yeah and I have the frequent urination it's like every two seconds I have to pee this is so annoying you can't even imagine but um, I'll get I get used to it and shortness of breath you can tell by me speaking to you talking to you guys you can tell that I'm out of breath you know it's like I'm running a marathon we are now talking just by talking I have um, now more stretch marks um, which I was expecting um, as well so there's something called nesting nesting is I'm gonna put the description um, on the screen for you lately I've been like that like this a lot because I feel like I'm, I'm about to to welcome the president in my house like everything is supposed to be perfect in the house because of the baby girl coming so yeah this is me nesting <laughs> and I've been very tired some some days I feel more energized and some other days I feel very tired and sleepy uh, but I think that's normal and yeah those are like the bad I, I'm not gonna say the bad but kind of like the most annoying um, symptoms but I have some beautiful part of it too for the third trimester which is the baby um, moving around because since she's bigger now I can feel the movement like very strong i can touch every part of her body you know it's so right now while i'm speaking she's moving and it's amazing it's an amazing feeling i can even like describe it put it into words to how beautiful it is how how happy i am when she's moving this is probably why she doesn't want to come out because mommy is so comfortable with her and she's so comfortable inside my belly and it's warm out in there it's safe so yeah so I, this is one of the feeling i'm gonna miss the most when i give birth because it's very magical and wonderful so i'm gonna be very nostalgic um about the pregnancy and i can say this pregnancy has been very smooth on me and i haven't had like big symptoms you know crazy symptoms the, the the symptoms i've been feeling they are very normal and basic um for me it doesn't bother me at all